Hi, welcome back. In this lecture, we'll see how to create a topic in a Kafka in our Spring Boot application. Well, in order to produce the messages and send to the topic, first we need to have a topic in our Kafka cluster, right? So if you can see the Kafka architecture over here, we have a Kafka cluster. Within a Kafka cluster, we can create any number of topics that we want. Okay, there is a no limitation basically whatever the topics that you want you can go ahead and create in a kafka cluster well in our case we have only one kafka broker service which is running on locally so it acts as a kafka cluster so within a kafka cluster we can create a topic and if you can see a topic can be again split into multiple partitions all right so we are not going to create the partition in a topic so whatever the kafka you know provides a default uh, partitions that we are going to use in our Spring Boot application. All right. So in order to produce the messages by producer and send to the topic, we need to have a topic in our Kafka cluster, right? All right. Head over to the IntiJ idea and let's create a topic in a Kafka cluster using Spring Boot application. Well, let's head over to the IntiJ idea here and let me minimize this and let me go to main package and I'm going to create a new package over here let's call it as compic all the configuration classes that we are going to keep within this compic package so right click on compic folder new one then choose java class and let's give class name as kapka kapka topic compic something like this okay so basically we are going to create a spring bin to configure the Kafka topic. So let's go and let's annotate this class with at configuration annotation so that this class acts as a Java Spring configuration class. So within this class, we are going to create a bin to create a you know Kafka topic. So just type public and then new topic. So make sure that you choose new topic from Kafka clients dot admin package. Let's give method name as Java guides topic and within this method we are going to create an instance of you know topic class. So let's have a return statement over here and let's use topic builder class from spring framework. Well here you can see org.springframework.kafka.compig. Okay make sure that you choose this topic builder class from this spring framework Kafka library and then you know call the name api and let's provide a name to the topic in our case let's say java guides okay so you can also split this topic into partitions in order to do that you can use partitions you know method and you can pass like any number let's say you want to split this topic into 10 partitions then you can go ahead and pass 10 over here all right so basically we are going to use a default partitions provided by Kafka so we're not going to create a partitions in this topic so after that just call build method in order to create the topic instance okay that's it now let's make this method as a spring bin by using at bin annotation okay that is pretty much it now we have created Kafka topic in a Kafka cluster using spring boot application well if you can run the spring boot application and you can see there are no errors it means whatever the code we have written to you know configure kafka topic is working as expected all right i will see you in the next lecture